Maximilian Lenz is West Bam. As a DJ, producer, and label head, he's been providing the world with electronic dance music for 30 years. His career began in Berlin in the 80s. His latest video includes footage from back then. You need a drug to make the stars come down. You need a drug to make you shine. West Bam's new album is an homage to nightlife in all its many facets. The song You Need the Drugs features vocals from Richard Butler of the British new wave band The Psychedelic Furs. Nightlife is excitement and sex, or the hope of sex, but also destroyed hopes, turn-offs, hangovers, drama. And I think that all these aspects should be included if you're going to do songs about nightlife. The 48-year-old drew on his own decades of club experience as well as his contacts in the international music scene. When it came time to record his eighth studio album, he had his pick of prominent guest vocalists like rock legend Iggy Pop, American rapper Kanye West, and Brian Molko, frontman of British rock band Placebo, as well as German pop icon Inga Humpa. It was a musical journey through four decades of musical history. There are so many really great voices that for me are really like classic sounds. Their vibrations evoke feelings that span the generations. We contacted some of them and I was really surprised how many people A, wanted to participate, and B, managed to come up with such great stuff after 20, 30 years in the music business. West Bam landed his first chart hit in 1989 with the track And Party. Since then, he's been producing one hit after the next. He also founded May Day, an annual rave for which he creates a new song every year. West Bam had his first big commercial success with the guys Members of May Day. The single Sonic Empire became a number one hit and sold more than 600,000 copies. Techno had gone mainstream. This is something that has potential. It's something that people can relate to because it reflects their own experiences. And that's exactly what it's supposed to be, the music of its time. And at some stage it crosses over and gets absorbed into everyday culture. More than a million people made their way to Berlin at the end of the 90s to take part in the biggest techno party in the world, the Love Parade. Westbam created the official anthem. This moment of euphoria. I always wanted to create a shared feeling of euphoria with electronic music. And I got to live out that dream in a huge public space with a million people at the Love Parade in Berlin. His DJ sets take him around the world. But West Bam wants to be successful as a producer, too. Success is when you make music, especially dance music, which has a notoriously short shelf life that people still get excited about 10 or 15 years later. Making tracks that are just the flavor of the month is pretty easy, but making something that still works a few years later, that's more difficult. After 30 years behind the decks, West Bam still wants just one thing, to create a timeless hit. And his latest single certainly has the potential to become one. <laughs> <laughs>